Have you heard about the MIT study, Limits to Growth, predicting our society could collapse by 2040? Initially criticized by the New York Times, recent reviews in 2014 and 2021 have shown that the report accurately predicted future events. Furthermore, KPMG's Gaia Harrington even suggests that we might be headed for collapse even sooner than predicted. So, are these warnings really coming true? And what does it mean to collapse sooner than predicted? Could it be by 2030? We have a situation where uh, something that is going to be far smarter than the smartest human. So I think we should be cautious with AI. I think there should be some government oversight uh, because it affects the, it, it's a danger to the public. Is I expect that by the end of this decade and possibly somewhat sooner than that, we will have quite capable systems that we look at and say, wow, that's really remarkable. Does humanity know what it's doing? No. I think we're moving into a period when, for the first time ever, we may have things more intelligent than us. The MIT study focused on analyzing the interactions between population, industrialization, pollution, food production, and resource depletion as drivers of potential collapse. However, they didn't know back then that there would be one thing that could become a major reason behind this collapse. And that thing is none other than AI, or artificial intelligence. Just Google it, and you'll find thousands of articles warning that AI is far more dangerous than we realize. The number of AI companies worldwide has nearly doubled since 2017, highlighting the explosive growth of the AI market. Not just that, but the global AI market is expected to exceed $1 trillion by 2028, growing 40% each year from 2023 to 2028. One of the biggest concerns is job displacement. As AI gets better at automating all sorts of tasks, it could lead to widespread unemployment, especially for those in routine, repetitive work. This economic instability could spread, causing businesses to fail and society to start falling apart. Take, for example, simple tasks. Advanced AI can easily replace many of these jobs. Humanoid robots are now being designed to move boxes and stack supplies for large retailers and manufacturers. Recently, the Challenger Jobs Report included a new category for AI-related job losses, reporting 3,900 jobs lost due to AI. This number could grow significantly as AI continues to advance. Companies like Dropbox, Tesla, and IBM are already laying off workers to invest more in AI. The demand for AI products is growing faster than anticipated, and the pace of change in the next five to 10 years will surpass the previous 30 years. The automation of automation is here, meaning software is increasingly capable capable of writing and maintaining itself. But it doesn't stop there. AI has the potential to be more dangerous than poor aircraft design or faulty car production. If AI becomes much smarter than humans, it will be very good at manipulation, having learned from us. Historically, more intelligent beings aren't controlled by less intelligent ones. AI knows how to program and can circumvent the restrictions we impose on it. Either you control the software or it controls you. There's also the risk of AI perpetuating and even amplifying existing biases and inequalities in society. If the algorithms powering these AI systems aren't carefully designed, they could end up making things even more unfair and divided. Another worry is the potential for AI to undermine trust and credibility. We're entering an era in which our enemies can make it look like anyone is saying anything at any point in time. Have I ever told you the story of the magical pistachio? I got lost in the grocery store and couldn't find my way out. But that's when I saw it, a glowing pistachio. David, David, I mean, I know you're a sophisticated guy. The world is a mess. The world is as angry as it gets. Well, you think this is going to cause a little more anger? Deepfakes, for example, could make it really hard to tell what's real and what's not, eroding faith in our institutions and leaders. And if AI is used for malicious purposes like hacking or propaganda, that could further destabilize the social fabric. Hey, Mom. Hey, Dad. It's me, Ella. Well, a digital version of me, just a bit older. Amazing what technology can do these days, isn't it? All you need are a couple of pictures, like the ones you share on social media, where they can be taken and used by everybody. I know, for you, these pictures are just memories. But for others, 
they are data. And for me, maybe the beginning of a horrible future. And then there's the really big existential risk of a technological singularity, where AI surpasses human capabilities in ways we can't even imagine. That could lead to a fundamental shift in the nature of society and human existence that's incredibly hard to predict or control. Singularity is where computers really change our view of what's important and change who we are. But we're getting close to some salient things that will change who we are. A key thing is 2029, when computers will pass the Turing test. Well, we have uploaded a video on our channel in which we have shared the seven scary stages of AI. Watch the video by clicking on the I button. Now, I don't want to sound too alarmist. A lot of this is still speculative. And there are also ways that AI could potentially help us address some of the challenges we're facing. But it's definitely an area that requires really careful thought and governance to make sure we're steering towards a positive future rather than one that could lead to societal collapse. Well, what are your thoughts on all this? Share your thoughts and check out these videos on your screen for more interesting AI-related content.